But we're talking about, you know, daily rain chances, but somehow we're not in rainy season yet. So Amanda's going to explain why. Yeah, we've seen some of those daily afternoon thunderstorms yes. even over the past couple of days. But there is a reason that we don't consider rainy season officially beginning until typically the end of May. So let's talk about the timeline. It generally is between May and October, but between May 1st and June 1st, our conditions are becoming favorable right now for those daily afternoon showers and storms. Now the peak uh, peak rainy season, peak storm season here doesn't happen between until Ju uh, July 1st and about August 1st. And then as we get later into fall, those conditions become a lot less favorable. On average for us here in the Tampa Bay area, rainy season doesn't start until May 25th, runs through October 10th. So here's why we need several ingredients before rainy season can officially say, we can say that it has officially begun. One of those being the Bermuda High in the Atlantic. This is a providing a steering current for a lot of those afternoon thunderstorms and of course our tropical systems right that hasn't set up just yet we also need water temperatures surpassing 82 degrees at the coast and offshore we're definitely not quite to that yet we're hovering right around 80 degrees and then of course you need moisture for those storms to form right so we need the moisture to increase not only at the surface yeah it's muggy out there right now but we need it in the upper levels of the atmosphere too and those dew points solidly in the 70s and they're not quite there just yet either so Lee, this is why we don't see the stormiest pattern start until June, and that's when we see the uptick in that average rainfall. Uh, yes, I mean, so still May and April, we're, we're still seeing our lower rainfall on average. But